Susanna Kolbenheyer, and I've been involved with hockey all my life. Kolbenheyer was the first registered female player in Hungary. She played 55 games with the Hungarian national team and served as GM of the women's national teams. She became an IIHF council member last September, and as chair of the IIHF Women's Hockey Committee, she plays a major role in the further development of the women's game. She was front and center at the recent Women's Under-18 High Performance Camp in Sheffield, England. I think that, uh, first of all, we, we try to convince the federations that uh, they should take serious women's hockey as well. There are a lot of federations who, who think that uh, only men's hockey is, is important and if we can convince them to think it uh, a little bit different and uh, support women's hockey, that would be a big effort for us. An important point is that the IIHF, through events and programs like the Women's Under-18 High Performance Camp in Sheffield, can definitely help shape the future of the women's game. But it is definitely the individual associations in their respective nations that really have to get behind the programs and do the majority of the heavy lifting. I think the IIHF should start these conversations with the federations. Um, I can give you an example. Um, I tried to convince uh, my colleague at the, at the council, uh, Henrik from Denmark, that uh, hey, why you don't have an under-18 team? And uh, he, he was just thinking a little bit and yes, we could have an under-18 team. And now I heard from the Danish coach here that uh, that they are, they, they will have a camp uh, at the end of August. They they will have all the under 18 players there. And maybe next year they will have an under 18 team. So I think that's what IIHF should do. Uh, start these conversations with the people who are really in charge of uh, female hockey. The IIHF Ambassador and Mentor Program, launched in July of 2011, continues to be a positive force for women's ice hockey. They have here uh, role models, uh, these athlete ambassadors from the US, Canada, Finland, Slovakia, and, and they can see that, that uh, what, what they uh, could reach with their hockey career. And I think that I think this is, this is very important to, to, to show them what they can become if, if, they, if they work hard and, and practice hard and, and just enjoy this sport. It will take time, and Colbin Hayer knows that, but she is determined in her role with the IIHF to push things along as quickly and positively as possible. Reporting for IIHF.com, I'm Paul Romanuk.